надеюсь, что эта конструкция не обвалится. This is all the sketchbooks that I have for all two years of drawing here and back to Warsaw. So I want to show for today this one. I wanted to talk with you about one of my absolute favorite notebooks from the Japanese brand called Midori. It is the A4 format and back then I was sketching on the go. By the way, the trusted tool for those sketches was my go-to Kaweco Fountain pen with the B-sides nib, paired with the ink from the oldest French brand of inks. Now let's take a little trip down memory line with some drawings I did a few years ago. These sketches capture people in Poland during the pandemic years, then masks were the norm. Funny thing, thanks to those masks, I improved my eye and nose drawing skills, but mouth? Well, it is still my artistic challenge. Talking of modern times in terms of people's look, I would also point out one more thing. Can you see how many people are staring at their phones? And it is not just about my choices of models during the trips, but it is the situation. And this is not a bad or good thing, I mean, it's just a reflection of how close this device is to us. I mean, I'm even recording this audio on the phone, okay? Also, it is an interesting point because the fun thing does not depend on a lot of causes. Since then I moved to a different country and now I see the exact same thing. You won't believe how grateful I am to those sketches. I started this habit during my hour-long trip commute to work. Sounds a bit mad, right? but it turned into my favorite part of the day. It is amazing how these tiny drawings hold so many memories. Like the lady with the phone and the dark hair, I meet her on my way from work on a rainy day. Quickly sketched her and now every detail brings back vivid memories. What I love most about those sketches is how the line of the sketches evolves from the first to the last drawing becoming more and more unique. It has made me truly appreciate the intricate details that make each person special.
and here you can see my love for drawing dogs not in this sketchbook though moving on to some color experiments there will be there will be more of those in the next pages i had some fun playing with colors combining oil pencils oil pastels and watercolor The two color versions added a nice touch to But hey, after all those experiments, I felt a little bit tired of this format, so it was time to let go and start fresh. Now check out the materials I used during the process. I've got my ultimate favorites like Kabeko and those who less in favor like Lama. I don't want to go very specifically in the aim of not to prolong this video too much but I definitely learned some pros and cons of each brand that I used. I'd love to drive deeper into this topic with you. With over a decade in the art field and also actually selling art products, I've got some tips and stories to share. So let me know what interests you in the comments below and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks for turning in guys and see you soon.